Yo dudes, what's going on? Hope your days have been dandy so far. So to, for today's video, I decided to actually bring out something different. I know I've been gone for a while. I had like exams and whatnot and a bunch of other responsibilities, uh, but I'm back making videos. But today I thought I'd actually show you guys how I make my videos. So how I make like the thumbnails, how I record them, what like what software I use and what equipment. Um, so first of all, I'll probably start off with like a little setup uh, tour, I guess. Now I warn you, my setup is nothing glamorous at all. Ready? Here it is. So, this is actually my dad's office. Um, it's not even really my space. Got my channel pulled up here. But um, yeah, basically use this laptop. It's it's amazing, it's really fast. Um, it's, it's a great laptop, that's all I can say. And I use this monitor and I sit down in this, this seat. Uh, it's got my dad's like jumper on it. But, um, yeah. Anyway, I sit down in this seat and I edit usually just on the monitor. Um, two two bits of software I use are one is Photop. It's like it's kind of like Photoshop, but it's like a free Photoshop. It's um, an online Photoshop software. And then this is a great website called Textcraft. It's for like YouTube making YouTube thumbnail text. Um, but yeah, Photop is usually what I use to make my thumbnails. I also use a website called Canva. If I can get it. Yeah, so I like go and create a design uh, YouTube thumbnail. And then obviously it's blank here. I usually go on like uploads and upload media. And then I get like an image from my computer and edit it here. So um, yeah, that's pretty much the software I use. If you guys want to use it for any YouTube, you can. Any YouTube videos. Oops, let's pause that. So that's all I can really say about the setup. Um, like the editing setup. Um, and I mean, it does everything it's supposed to. So now I was thinking that I could go my gaming setup. So basically, where I, you know, where I play games and where I obtain the gameplay um, for the for the videos. So let's go. Let's switch that off. See the electricity. So this is the kitchen. You look at this little hallway here, and into my room. This is my bed. I've got a bag here because I'm going to get some friends soon. But uh, anyway, the main attraction, the gaming setup. So this is pretty much it. This is my TV. Hello, hello there. Uh, this is this is just a notepad full of um, Dark Matter Ultra guns. You know, guns that I need to get gold for DM Ultra. Uh, and I'm making good progress. I've got the SMGs, the snipers, attack rifles, and uh, shotguns done. And I've got some of the ARs done, the Sigma and uh, done, and I've, I've still got like. 12, 13 to go, so just about happy there. Um, and then I have my Xbox 360, it's the slim black one, amazing console, I love that, I've been playing it for years and it still works perfectly. Uh, my Xbox One, right here, is also a great console. Uh, for those of you wondering, I am Xbox, I'm not PlayStation, although I don't like PlayStation. This is a DVD player, I think I do have a Wii somewhere in this mess. This is my headset. Um, I've got some like, Fortnite figures here. From like way back when Fortnite was actually actually relevant and it was actually a good game. Uh, I've got a controller stand here, so it's uh, it charges your controllers. And these are actually Xbox One S controllers. Um, I can't remember the name. Venom. Yeah, there we go. Venom. That's the brand I use. Um, I've got some games here. FIFA, Overwatch. I actually a lot of these I don't play. My brother does, but I play Overwatch. Uh, let me see what else. I've also got an Xbox uh, Connect here as well, 360. So it was like a, a bundle, I got like the, the Connect and 360 all in one bundle and uh, it's an amazing console. Up here I've got some like, I've got this big pennant, can I get a hell yeah, uh, to keep me motivated because believe it or not, I do rage at COD. I think everyone does every now and then, so that keeps me motivated when I'm going for those insanely tricky guns. Uh, I've got a Doctor Who little, but I don't know what's that, what that's called, a little poster or something. A vault tech flag, so I'm a Fallout fan. Uh, oh, over here I've got an applause sign. There's a mirror. Let me see if I actually... Oh, it's high on. Let me see if I can switch this off. It's not plugged in. That would help. If I want to plug it in. Uh, let me... Let me put this down. Oh, just... Temporarily. There we go. Okay. 
then I'll try now. Okay, why? Well, that's still not working. Oh, because the point isn't switched on. No, let me try. There we go. Ta da! The applause sign. Um, let's see, I've got. This is kind of my my and my brothers. Um, he's got like this Paris noodle. It's his. And there's like some pencils and pens here just for writing, I guess. This is like a fidget cube he also has, but he never uses it. This is his portable speaker. He never uses that either. This is like my kind of um, nerdy corner, I guess you could call it. Got Tie Fighter, Joy Decker, Slavine. This is like a Star Wars light that's got like little ships in it. I've uh, got some more characters, you know, Han Solo, two R two R T D twos. I don't know why I have both of those. An Obi Wan, uh, Baby Groot, uh, Trooper, no, Clone Trooper. Sorry. Uh, oh, this is a cool Zelda Triforce light that I have. And actually, I actually don't know if you can see that, but it projects an eagle. Except it's well, I mean, it's, it's broad daylight, so it's not going to work right now. But it, it does in the dark, trust me. So yeah, this is pretty much, oh, this is where I sit. I know it's an awful chair, it's really messy. Uh, I usually just sit there, you know, I sit like, that way, I'll show you. I'm trying to show you a demonstration. Um, I don't know if I'm in frame, I should be. I usually just sit here and just, I try and sit up straight, cause it's not if you're balancing like this, but I have to try hard and sit like this. But I usually sit on the chair, this game, Occasionally I'll sit on the couch, a really cool Death Star cushion for it. Um, and yeah, that's, that's pretty much the gaming setup. It's simple, but it works. It's a great TV. And, um, oh, is it fun? Uh, yeah, it's, that's pretty much the setup. But it works, you know, it's effective. Um, it's my little slice of heaven, I guess, my little, little, little gaming corner, because it's right in the corner of the room. So, um, yeah. So yeah, that was just a quick, um, I guess, setup tour if you want to call it that. Um, I also, oh, I'll show you how I record my gameplays. Um, to edit them, I use this app called Video Joiner. It's a free app I have on my phone. Uh, it's an amazing app, it does everything you want. There's a premium version, but you honestly don't need it. Let me show you what I use to record the gameplays. I don't use an Elgato, if I can find this thing. Okay, it's not in here. That is interesting. Let me find out. I can't work this. It'll be in this box of mess. This is bad. Here, here we go. I use a record. Uh, a record on my game, please. But it's bad boy. Don't focus. Why isn't that focusing? Yeah, there we go, SanDisk USB 3.0. Um, I basically record, I use like the built-in um, game recorder or screen capture on the Xbox One. And then I transfer captures onto here, to which I then format them onto the computer. And that's pretty much it. I put them on the computer, edit them to my phone and put a face cam over them, which more videos will be coming soon, actually. Because uh, like I said, I was focused right now. There we go. Uh, I was like super busy, but now I'm actually, well I'm free, I'm free for exams, I graduated high school. So that, that's amazing. I have a lot more free time on my hands. So a lot more videos will be coming, I have a lot more comms, I'm getting more comms from the face cam thing. Uh, and I'm still like learning, you know, I'm still fairly new to making like actual YouTube videos. Because I did a few years ago, but those ones were really bad. I took them down, thankfully. Um, yeah, that's pretty much been it. Um, I have, this video will probably be up. And I've got a commentary coming up about the best, or one of the best weeks of my life. I'm not sure what will be up first, but one of them will be, I think this will be up first. Um, so I just wanted to mix it up, because you know, I will have more, you know, Call of Duty gameplays. Um, I'm thinking about maybe branching into other games, maybe Overwatch, because I'm, I'm actually quite a big Overwatch fan as well. And I don't want to be playing the same games over and over again or I'll get burnt out very quickly. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much been it. Um, if you have any questions about like software or anything I use or how, how I edit exactly um, or specifically, then you can leave them in the comments down below. Um, but 
I think I've pretty much covered everything. I'm trying to think, and I've covered pretty much everything from how I make my thumbnails, how I capture the gameplays, how I edit the videos. Um, everything's been covered, so um, yeah. I really hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, feel free to toss I like my way and maybe possibly even consider subscribing. That is something you could do. And I'll see you dudes on the other side. Peace out, people. So I just realized I actually forgot to show you guys something. Um, it is the next day, hence why I have this new t-shirt on. Uh, but I forgot to show you guys where I keep my games. Now, I actually keep them in two separate parts. Uh, the COD games have their own designated storage space, and I'm super nerdy. Um, it's underneath my bed. This box used to just be dedicated to my COD games. But since I graduated um, high school, I don't really need my bag until I go off to uni. So I'm just keeping it here. So yeah, here we are. Oh, uh, I did, I actually had sorted them, but that's kind of going out the window. Um, there we go. BO4, uh, MW1, MW2, BO1, BO2. Ghosts, underrated game by the way, just, just put that out there. BO3, World War 2, and also over here, I have MW3 as I was playing that uh, earlier on today. Um, so the tolls are kept underneath my bed, but the rest of my games are actually kept in this chest. I just put this down. Here we are, in this chest. Whoa. Um, so this half is like all the Skylander figures, when my brother likes Skylanders. But this is just all the explosives, like assorted explosives games, um, so it's what one game's there. Got some DS games, and we can go here, a few. Um, but yeah, that's... It's all contained in this massive chest. Um, I'm thinking about maybe moving these or like uh, trying to sell them or something. Which means I can put them away so I can actually get this organized. Because right now they're just crammed together and you have to get out. I actually used to have a lot more in here. Like um, these games here are like the survivors. And when I sold a ton of my games like a few years ago, I sold them out. Um, let's put it in context, let's say this is a third of what I had, and probably three times that. So this entire chest was filled with just games crammed together. Um, but I realised I didn't need a lot of them, so I sold them for some money uh, to actually save up for a new phone. Um, and I'm kind of glad I did that, because my collection is still decently sized, but um, there's actually just... There isn't a very wide range... I don't know, I play a fair of the wide range of games, but like... There's a select few games I actually like, really, really love that I play, mainly the Cold Seas, uh, and also like, Overwatch, I like Strange, like, you know, I love this game to death, and uh, I love doing like Sephora and the Pico and that, um, and also, I also play my Pico, a bit of GTA, but where I did occasionally, on like, occasion. Um, but yeah, uh, the collection used to be much better, but it's still just decently sized. But I don't usually play these. Um, so I can put that out there, I may be just pick a little bit of it, really these. And then we just disregard these games. So we just pop up out, and um, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much what the game's there. And in there, because I forgot to show you guys yesterday where I kept them. Nice.